Hello, Andrew Holly here with a video on the ETS 2. This is going to be a showcase of my Scania R5. Well, my Scania 143M 500 horsepower. So, let's begin by moving this on my little brake pipe. Beautiful, 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 absolute stunning truck. So, as I said, this is the Scania 143M 500 horsepower. She has a 500 horsepower V8 with around about 2,000 newton meters of torque. And she's set up for carrying heavy cargo, as by, you can tell, with the 6x4. So if you have a look under here, she has got a drive shaft that goes to both set of wheels with two diffs. And she can pull up to, well, I've had her pulling up to 55 tons. So, look at this. Truck of the year 1989. That's three years after I was born. And, well, they don't make trucks like this anymore. I wish they would. So, this is my setup. I've went for the old classic of the yellow lights. Absolute wonderful one there. And I've got two round headlamps there because, well, they looked good. Four of the rectangle ones because they look even better. Oh look, four more rectangle ones. Tells you about rectangle well, it's better. On the top, four horns, an air conditioning unit, two beacons for obviously the heavy hull, and, well, as you can tell, have a look inside. There's Pikachu, my sidekick. The Scania logo. A laptop, I'll show you what that does in a second. Because of geek in me, obviously, the DeLorean. This is the Back to the Future, no, this is the first version, because it's got the tail hook on. Scania, obviously, need a Scania. This, if you're wondering what this is, this is a Fallout 3 T-51B helmet. We have a telepath system, so I can, well, it's on show, but you can bypass tow boosts. You can just literally drive straight through without any problems. Obviously, the Fallout Vault Tech Boy bobblehead. This does move in turning. And at at, obviously, Star Wars. And on the other side, Millennium Falcon. We have a CB for, obviously, you can have this with a CB with the. On the right hand side or the left hand side, I've had. Well, obviously, because this is left hand drive, this is on the left. And then obviously some flags, Scania, Scania, Tracker, American Track Sim, because I have that as well. World of Tracks, because I'm on World of Tracks. This little gizmo, probably, if it if it works, it's supposed to set up for telling me when the speed cameras are, but I'll turn the police off. Because sometimes, well, this track likes to move. Chrome exhausts, obviously, need them. If you're going to have a V8, have big exhausts. And obviously, a couple more indicators, reverse lights, extra brake lights, 
mask lights make sure to be seen because yes I know this is black so of course black is well black is very nice especially when you have chrome on so let's just have a look at what it looks like lit up so there's all the lights yeah. tell me if you can't see that Mount it side, extra marker lights, across the back, extra marker lights, blur and, blur and reverse. Got one on there and the two up there. And obviously, the tiny engine on for the extra light acid light two there two down the bottom there and two up there now this is probably going to be a bit bright but it is the high beam up properly. Hand auxiliary, roof auxiliary. So there we go. Definitely, definitely need them. Because we've got two beacon lights. That is how the nameplate, one says Loony, the other says Stig, that is my nickname, Loony Stig. It's been my nickname since, well, since I start driving buses. Lovely V8. This is an absolute lovely track to drive. I do have other tracks which I will show you in my company and all that kind of The one I drive the most is this. I'm old fashioned, I like old old vehicles. Uh, 1980s, obviously, you know, well, when I was born. 89 track of the year track and obviously the 500 is a rare track so so obviously rare track we're gonna need a yeah. is obviously my favourite so Without further ado, this is where are we in Copenhagen, aren't we? Yep, we're in Copenhagen or Haven. So this has been my Scania. After I keep saying R, it's not. It's a Scania 143M 500 V8 with all the bells and whistles. Oh. And I just love this truck. Is the uh, the 
this is my five, 500 horsepower monster. Right, thank you very much for watching and bye bye.